I've lived next door for 44 years to the building they want to scrap. And uh, sorry, it's um, Wormholt Library, and it's a listed building. I understood when I bought my place that next door was listed. So they listed my place up to number 20, the curb. And now they want to take it off the listed list so they can rebuild. And we think it's downright disgusting to take a building like that away. Oh, I know it's all money, you know, but um, there's a lot to be said to have dignity in this life. And um, they've taken that away <laughs> by destroying the community. Yeah. No, it's greed. Greed. It's either a greed or they're getting a backhander from somewhere. <laughs> I, I used to work in this building. Fifteen years I was here. And um, I've lived and worked in Hammersmith and Fulham for 50 odd years. I'm a Fulham supporter, if that's any good. <laughs> And, um, and I, I probably will do until I die. Yeah. It's a fact yeah. of life, isn't it? Fulham, actually. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, Fulham. Well, I don't mind paying more. For God's sake, I mean, I'm only working for I mean, I'm not bloody caught and wound. Exactly. Yeah. They're burning their millions, you know, and, and these uh, people there who do not pay tax. Millionaires taking their yeah, offshore. Do you know what the amount is? The dodging is going yeah. off. The better off get social security. Most of it is spent on the better off in social security. Only, only a, a small factor of it uh, on, the, on the less better off yeah. to start with. And the amount being fiddled is about 100 billion. Right. Or 100 billion. Roughly. You would take a few million. Like that. Disgusting. And people yeah, they put the squeeze on people like you and me. People don't mind that because, you know, if they want me to pay this, give me, give me more money, I'll pay it. But you see, they're going to keep doing it until we kick the, count, kick the council out. So you've got to do that. Well, I think you've got to kick the government out and let them do it because they paid the way for it, this, this council. This one. They're privatising all the... I tell you, when you see these councils, they're going to be privatised. So you get a company saying, so we're, we're your landlord. I'm going to say, up yours, I'm not going to, we're not going to do it, I'm going to pay no bit, you put me out. And we're going to have a big bit of demonstrations in very soon. So look, we want you out. You want us out, we want you out, simple like that. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. And those are other people who are worse off than me, I mean, I'm like, the thing is, if, if I can't really let them do it, I'll be even worse off. Because if you lie down, they're going to kick, kick your head in. You know, honestly, I'm scared, I'm old, you know, I mean, I'm like, what about National Health Service? The people, you know, they're starving people are dead. In this country, 21st century, starving people are dead in hospital. In the name of Christ, this is, this is Europe. Mm. They don't even do that in Russia, do they? No, it's supposed to be in a developed country, aren't we? Yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, people have got to die. I mean, people, you know, they're old people. They can't defend themselves. And they've been, there's a lot of mistreatment of these old people. Half a million have been old, ill-treated. I'm not saying they've been hit or beaten up, they've been pushed and slapped and something like that. They can't defend themselves. Mm -hmm. See what they saying. fought for a sick world war. That's what we do to them, 80s or 90s. Yeah, well, there, there's no respect for or, or no, that no. kind of thing, value anymore. Yeah, I um, don't have to pay for it anyway. I mean, quite by now, I don't do a damn thing. I want this council out. <laughs>